You're not going anywhere until you tell me what a quidgybo is. Quidgybo? Uh, a big, dumb, balding North American ape with no chin. And a short temper. P.U. When is this over? It ain't over till the fat lady sings. Is that one bad enough for you, son? <laughs> <laughs> but you do know what happens when you mix acids and bases, right? Of course I do. Sorry. There must be some beer here somewhere. Ah, maybe in here. Damn! I need money! Our city is under siege. By a graffiti band known as El Barto. Police artists of a composite sketch to call for it. If anyone has any information, please contact us immediately. Cool, man. Hey, isn't that your boy there torturing the swans? Bark! Well, I sense greatness in my family. Your family? Well, it's a greatness that others can't see. But it's there, and if it's not true greatness we have, we're at least average. Thank you for this microwave bounty, even though we don't deserve it. I mean, our kids are uncontrollable hellions, pardon my French, but they act like savages. Did you see them at the picnic? Oh, of course you did. You're everywhere. You're omnivorous. Oh, Lord, why did you smite me with this family? Look at that, kids. No fighting, no yelling. No belching. The dad has a shirt on. Look, knackers. Honey, you have a problem, and it won't get better till you admit it. I admit this. You better shut your big yap. Oh, you shut up. No, you shut up. No, you shut oh, up. Oh, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Why don't you both shut up? Uh-oh, there's your bell. Come along now, all of you. No dawdling now. I'll get you after school, man. But... Oh, no, no, no. He'll get you after school, son. Now hurry up. It's time for class. <coughs> oh, boy, you sure taught me a lesson. Whoo. Thanks, guys. I guess now all that's left is a hearty handshake. Let me help you dry those tears. Bart, you can't go on like this. I know. I am disgusted with the way old people are depicted on television. We are not all vibrant, fun-loving sex maniacs. Many of us are bitter, resentful individuals who remember the good old days. In the red trunks, with the record of 48 wins and no losses, the undisputed champ of this house, battling Bart Simpson, with a record of zero wins and 48 defeats. Oh, correction, humiliating defeats, all of them by knockout. Must you do this every time? Homer, the human punching bag, Simpson. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait, I can't get my... Get out of the way, stupid. Get over... To the right. I'm so lonely since my baby left me. I got no money and nothing is free. Ooh. Aha! Got him! Although the creature was ultimately released, the question remains, who was this Homer? Was it a man, or was it in fact the legendary missing link known as Bigfoot? Can I have some applesauce? <laughs> what do I tell the boss? Tell him I'm going to the back seat of my car with a woman I love, and I won't be back for ten minutes! <laughs> Crusty's been reading a magazine if he can't read. 
Hey, hey, this is not a lending library. If you're not going to buy that thing, put it down or I'll blow your heads off. Hello, this is Mr. Samson. Did your wife just call a second ago? No, I said Samson, not Simpson. Thank God. Those Simpsons, what a bunch of savages. Especially that big ape father. Go! Oh! Hmm? Grateful grandchild. Try again, if you dare. <gasps> Ooh! Gorilla the Conqueror, the granddaddy of them all. <laughs> Forget you, pal. Thanks for nothing. <laughs> so I say... Forget you, pal. Thanks for nothing. And I storm right out of there. You are so beautiful. To me. Very good, Earth Boy. Excellent, Mr. Simpson. Well, Simpsy, you up for another wave? All right, Bergie. <laughs> you are my brother. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> and yet, I feel a great sadness <laughs> in my bosom. <laughs> Oh, Lord, on this blessed day, we thank Thee for giving our family one more crack at togetherness. Amen. Amen. I'm going to make it. I'm going to make it. Woo! I... You heard me. I won't be in for the rest of the week. I told you. My baby beat me up. Hello, I'm Kent Brockman, and welcome to another edition of Smartline. Are cartoons too violent for children? Most people would say, no, of course not. What kind of stupid question is that? But one woman says, yes. And she's here with us tonight, Mrs. Marge Simpson. There she is! Share, share, love and share, love and share, share, love, share, 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 share. The itchy and scratchy show. Please, do not be alarmed. Our chefs are just saying hello. Oh, okay. Hello! Don't be alarmed. Don't be alarmed. Don't be alarmed. Beautiful language, isn't it, Mark? See more butts. Hey, everybody, I want to see more butts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Listen, you little scum-sucking puss bucket. When I get my hands on you, I'm going to pull out your eyeballs with a corkscrew. He certainly broke up that meeting. Right now, I'm thinking about holding another meeting in bed. All my life, I have searched for a car that feels a certain way. Powerful like a gorilla, yet soft and yielding like a Nerf ball. Now at last, I have found it. <gasps> Assassins! Oh, 125 bucks. Sometimes you gotta spoil yourself. Spoil yourself. Spoil yourself. But I can't afford to... Simpson, I order you to buy those shoes! Okay, Flanders, you're the boss. <laughs> No! I think the baby might be yours. Oh, I'm sure it is, dollface. 
But I'd like to see you prove it. You treat me like garbage. <laughs> that's because that's the way you love it, baby. <laughs> Ooh, macadamia nut. If you'd like to buy some, they're only a dollar each. Oh, so that's your little plan. Get us addicted, then jack up the price. Well, you win. I've been wanting to tell you all for years, but I never had the nerve. Um, I don't know you. My wife and your wife are friends. We met just three hours ago. You stink! You and your whole lousy operation stinks! I quit! Homer, do you remember the way you acted at the party last night? The way I acted? So I said I must get out of these wet clothes and into a dry martini. <laughs> oh, well, oh, you puppies again. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, my name is Mr. Burns. I believe you have a letter for me. Okay, Mr. Burns. Uh, what's your first name? I don't know. Happy birthday. Overlooked middle child. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> mm, I thought you might want a snuggle. That reminds me. Seven ways to spice up your marriage. <clears throat> Marge, you have a nice body. And if you'd like to see me in a costume, you have only to ask. Thank you, homie. <laughs> hey, what's so funny? Oh, Marge, grow up. Come on, touch it, death, touch it, death, touch it, death. In those days, instead of being wrapped in a hygienic package, chocolate was wrapped in a tobacco leaf. And instead of being pure chocolate like we have today, it was mixed with shredded tobacco, and they didn't eat it. They smoked it. Magic Johnson coming down the floor on a fast break. Magic stops. His feet slip out from under him. The ball flies out of his hand. Hits the referee in the head. Goes in the basket. It's a three-point play. The Lakers win. Looks like I pulled a homer. Go wait in the car. <laughs> oh, we could have seen a monkey. Uh, uh, uh. Every day, same old cat. I'll make it more interesting. Uh, hey, everybody. I'm a stupid moron with an ugly face and a big butt, and my butt smells, and I like to kiss my own butt. <laughs> This act is over. Mmm, salty. Oh my God, are you stealing squishies? No, sir. <laughs> I'm not gonna make it. Oh, stop talking crazy. No, 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 no. Just do one thing for me. Get me Dosa. You can use me. I'm good. I built a lot of things around the house. The spice rack. The bird feeder. The gymboree. And we visit with heavyweight champion Dredrick Tatum, who reminisces about growing up in Springfield. That town is a dump. If you ever see me back there, you know I really f***ed up bad. Mo, mo, mo. When Bart's done, can we mow to the movies? There's a moat name. Of course. All work and mow play makes mow a moat mow. Mow 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 Hey, Homer. 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 Hey,
I won't let you down. I swear to you, when you come out of there, the first thing you're going to see is a man with a good job. Yeah, the doctor. <laughs> Larry the looter. <laughs> All right, stick it to the man. Hey, Mom, did you save the love letters Dad sent you? Of course I saved them. Although, actually, there's only one. And it's more of a love postcard from some brewery you visited. Maybe it's severe talking, Marge, but you got a butt that won't quit. They got these big chewy pretzels here that are all you guys with a beer. So five dollars? Get out of here. <laughs> Let's see it again in super slow motion. You're Daryl Strawberry. Yes. You play right field. Yes. I play right field too. So? Well, are you better than me? Well, I never met you, but yes. I got it! I got it! Yes! Hey, I called for that. Put a lid on it, Simpson. There's no I in team. Some of these guys have a bad attitude, Skip. They sure do, Strawberry. Mattingly, get rid of those sideburns. What sideburns? You heard me, hippie. Dr. Hibbert, Ken Griffey Jr. needs to see you immediately. We think it's an overdose of nerve tonic. Good Lord. Gigantism. <gasps> Mattingly! I thought I told you to trim those sideburns! Go home! You're off the team! For good! Clear! <laughs> Clear! <laughs> Doctor, he's gone. <sighs> this is the part of the job I hate. No! What? You are not going to perform that operation yourself. But Marge, it looks so easy. Just like carving a turkey. <laughs> Have you found a picture yet? Mm, not one that I want the public to see. Mm. Oh. Mm. Oh, dear. A G Q seven. Close enough. May you drive safely and find true love. Would he like to lose weight? Stop smoking? Learn the state capitals? Master hostage negotiations? Hmm. Hostage negotiations. Listen, Taboli. We're ignoring all of your demands. What do you say to that? Of course, there is the unpleasant matter of the bill. Get to the point. 1150 bones. That's all I got. Broke again, eh, Herb? Just like in real life. <laughs> I guess you're just that much of a businessman. Oh. Now, I bet you're all wondering what lies under this sheet. Not really. We peeked inside while you were in the john. Oh. Well, here it is again. My baby translator. Whoa! I have soiled myself. How embarrassing. I'm whizzing with the door open, and I love it! Dear Lord, may your loving hand guide Homer to the mattress square and true. College football diverts funds badly needed for education and the arts! <laughs> Is that true? Let's get him! <laughs> Let's get out of here! <laughs> My baloney has a first name, it's H-O-M-E-R. My baloney has a second name, it's H-O-M-E-R. Hey, Homer, cut it out. Come on, quit eating me. Ow! Nice shot, Carl. No, no! Uh. Captain Klingon's off the starboard bow. Again with the Klingons. Mr. Scott, give me full power. It's no good, Captain. 
I cannot reach the control panel. Prepare to be blown away by Bang Bang Bark! Oh, here comes the conservative judge. Plead insanity. Plead insanity. It's not working. Uh oh, my heart just stopped. Ah, there it goes. Our tireless safety engineers crash test over 1,000 cars a year. Hey, wait. It's not a dummy. This exhibit is closed. Hello, hi, Mr. Plow. Are you tired of having your hands cut off by snow blowers and the inevitable heart attacks that come with shoveling snow? Uh-huh. So remember, call Mr. Plow. That's my name. That name again is Mr. Plow. Mr. Plow is a loser and I think he is a boozer. <laughs> so, so you better make, make that, that call to, to the, the Plow King. Mr. Plow, that name again is Mr. Plow. Hello, I'm calling from delinquent accounts at Kumatsu Motors. Oh, you want the Mr. Plow who plows driveways. This is Tony Plow, you know, from Leave it to Beaver. Come on, give me the key. These look like teeth marks. I thought there was chocolate inside. Well, why was it wrapped in foil? It was never wrapped in foil. When the working day is done, Girls just wanna have fun. That's all we really want. Well, once we get the cats out of the way, it won't be too bad. Actually, according to the will, the cats own the house. You'd be their tenants. I wish we lived in the kitty house. We'll look at the courageous Korean gymnast, Kim Hwan, who made a perfect dismount on what was later revealed to be a broken leg. Ah! Honey, you really shouldn't eat so much in bed. It's not good for your heart. My heart is just... Ah! Ah! Homie, what is it? Just working the turkey through. There it goes. Now, I know I haven't been the best Christian, in fact, when you're up there blah, blah, blahing, I'm usually doodling or mentally undressing the female parishioners. Well, anywho, can I have $40,000? We passed this card around at work. Gee, thanks, guys. They had a hell of a time replacing you. And we are back with more of People Who Look Like Things. Coming soon, it's Truckasaurus, the movie, starring Marlon Brando as the voice of John Truckasaurus. You crazy car. I don't know whether to eat you or kiss you. Am I turning you on? No. What if I undo this button? Good night, Homer. What if I talk like this? What if I sing to you? I gave my love a chicken, it had no bone. Mmm, chicken. Cool. Biscuits, chicken, yellow, mailman. You're reading the wine list, sir. Very good. Beer goggles. See the world through the eyes of a drunk. Wow! You're charming the pants off of me. What did you say, Aunt Selma? I said take off those damn glasses. I am woman, hear me roar, and numbers too big to ignore. And I know too much to go back to pretend. Hi, uh, you've reached the Corey hotline. Four ninety-five a minute. Here are some words that rhyme with Corey. Glory. Story. <sighs> allegory. Montessori. That's my collection of fur balls and stomach acid. <laughs> you idiot! You're trying to kill me, man! <laughs> <laughs> Wars! Now here's 
Here's a clip from 1973. Try to run, try to hide, break on through to the other side. Yeah! Well, off to the plant, then to the Duff Brewery. Uh-oh. Did I say that or just think it? I gotta think of a lie fast. Homer, are you going to the Duff Brewery? Only Duff fills your Q zone with pure beer goodness. So drink up, and up, and up! What does the future hold for Duff? <laughs> Let's just say we've got a few ideas up our sleeve. Like what? Um, I'd rather not get into it right now. Why not? All right. We don't have any ideas for the future. We got nothing. Happy? No. Mmm, gummy beer. Do you ever hide beer around the house? Do I ever? Do you ever drink to escape from reality? When I was 17, I drank some very good beer. I drank some very good beer I purchased with a fake ID. My name was Brian McKee. Down with sexism! Look at all those feminists. You thinking what I'm thinking? <laughs> yeah. 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 All right. <laughs> yeah! All right! Yeah! Dental plan! Lisa needs braces. Bullseye! <laughs> Thanks a lot, Carl. Now I've lost my train of thought. Dental plan! Lisa needs braces. Dental plan! Lisa needs braces. Don Homer, my son, he has a trouble with the... Uh... Eh, 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 eh. Molto bene. Guys are always patting my bald head for luck, pinching my belly to hear my girlish laugh. Hmm, that doesn't sound like they like you at all. You know, I think you're right. First thing tomorrow morning, I'm going to punch Lenny in the back of the head. What the hell was that? A lot of people know about the grotto and the game room. Of course. But few know about the laboratory, the biosphere, the Alternative Energy Research Center. Fascinating. Oh boy, free trading cards. Wow, Joseph of Arimathea. 26 conversions in AD 46. Whoa, a Methuselah rookie card. Goodbye. 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 Goodbye, Goodbye my Coney Island baby. That's my son up there. What, the balding fat ass? Uh, no, the Hindu guy. Hi, kids. I love you. <laughs> Barbershop shop is in danger of growing stale. I'm taking it to strange new places. Number eight. Uh. Number eight. Uh. Number eight. Uh. Number eight. Uh. With my baby. Because the schools can't force you like they should. Ma, these new finger razors make heads trimming as much fun as sitting through church. We have places your family can hide in peace and security. Cape Fear, Terror Lake, New Horror Field, Screamville. Ooh, Ice Creamville. Uh, no, Screamville. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> 
The preparations for your birthday have begun. They won't get what I really want. No one does. Happy birthday, Mr. Smithers. Hey, Apu, this bag of ice has a head in it. Ooh, a head bag. Those are chock full of heady goodness. He's going to have to give me my own recording studio. Do all beef patty, special sauce, lettuce, cheese, pickles, onions, onions, sesame seed bun. <laughs> Homer, you're drooling on the mic again. Excellent. Dad, do you notice anything strange? Yeah, his hairdo looks so queer. I heard that. He was a boy. Homer, please, you know it's hard for me to make friends. Oh, Marge, we should do this every Thursday. Marge, I got sprayed by the skunk. Oh, oh look, it's doing it again. <gasps> Would you uh, care to dance? Mayor Quimby, what are you doing here? I'm uh, here with my nephews. Oh, that's nice. Checkmate, Mr. Trampoline. <laughs> Good afternoon and welcome to the Do What You Feel Festival. By the way, this young lady is not my wife, but I am sleeping with her. I'm telling you this because I'm comfortable with my womanizing. Yay! Oh, she won't hold. She's breaking up. All done. If you survive, please come again. Bart, Bart, Bart. Give me that. <laughs> Ooh, floor pipe. Hey. Is that too good? I'm not sure, sir. It was here when we moved in. But I still stand by my hiring policies. Get back to work, Stuart. Your appearance is comical to me. <laughs> I'm a nerd. <gasps> Hey, Homer, you're hallucinating again. Not a good sign. Mo, I need your advice. Yeah? See, I got this friend named Joey Jojo Jr. Shabadoo. That's the worst name I ever heard. Oh, no. Hey, Joey Jojo! Think on sexy thoughts, think on sexy thoughts. <laughs> well, this is my floor. <laughs> It's a sign! So this stuff really works? Certainly does. Oh, well, lots of luck! Okay, hiya. Oh, Margie, you came and you found me a turkey on my vacation away from worky. Hubba hubba. I remember that meeting and I have a photographic memory. Legalized gambling is a bad idea. You can build a casino over my dead body. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. For you, it's the president. Yellow. Behold the box of mystery. The cat goes in right here. Yo, 
check this out. Black guys drive a car like this. Ding, ding, ding. Yeah, but white guys, see, they drive a car like this. Okay, good. Book me a flight, rent me an igloo, and tell those dorks at the Quickie Mart that, boom, I am out of here. I'm a dot. I'm gone, okay? What do you mean I got to give two weeks notice? What? I'm freaking no good mother... Jeez. Is it true you once worked 96 hours straight? Oh, yes. It was horrible, I tell you. By the end, I thought I was a hummingbird of some kind. Oh, yeah. You know, I studied your old security tapes. But as for me, I'm off to battle aliens on a faraway planet. That sounds like a good movie. Yes. Yes, a, a movie, yes. People, we're in danger of losing our funding. America isn't interested in space exploration anymore. Maybe we should finally tell them a big secret. That all the chimps we sent into space came back super intelligent. No, I don't think we'll be telling them that. <laughs> Since they made me stop drinking, I've regained my balance and diction. Observe. I am the very model of a modern major general. I'm information vegetable, animal, and mineral. Oh, that's nothing. What's this? There once was a man from Nantucket who's bound! Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'd like you to meet the two experienced astronauts who will accompany the winner into space. Ray Spanion and Buzz Aldrin, the second man on the moon. Second comes right after first. And we'd like to... Ah! Ah! Ladies and gentlemen, uh... We've just lost the picture, but uh, what we've seen speaks for itself. The Corvair spacecraft has apparently been taken over, conquered, if you will, by a master race of giant space ants. <laughs> the walls are melting again. <laughs> Personally, I think I'm overdone. Ooh, you brought me a nacho hat. Thanks, Ned. Nacho, nacho man. I want to be a nacho man. Don't worry. I brought my rapping Ronnie Reagan tape. It always makes the trip go faster. Well, 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 well. <laughs> you know something? He did say well a lot. Hey, Clinton, get back to work. Mike me. Five, 23, skidoo, hut, hut. <laughs> I'm afraid your family doesn't want you back. I do not miss Bart at all. I am glad he's gone. As am I. Bo! Shouldn't we wait for the other babies before we open the presents? We didn't invite the other babies. Maggie doesn't seem to get along with the other babies. That's not my mother. I'll be back in a jiffy. Can I come to? Oh. Oh, what possible reason could you have against Grandpa being in love? If he marries your mother, Marge, we'll be brother and sister. And then our kids, they'll be horrible freaks with pink skin, no overbites, and five fingers on each hand. <laughs> ah! Now what you gotta do? If you want to get a kiss, is act real smooth and make your move like this. <gasps> oh, I see. Now, what's that rule? Say it cool. All right, here's the 411, folks. Say some gangsta is dissing your fly girl. You just give him one of these. We need someone to teach a course on how to build a successful marriage. I'll do it. Anything to get me out of that house away from all that nagging and noise of a family of love. Sha la la la. In America, first you get the sugar, then you get the power, then you get the women. <laughs> Better find a motel and stop for the night. We don't need to do that, March. I'm not tired. I'm not tired at all. Ooh, 
glad that wasn't us. Cool, personalized plates. Barclay, Barry, Bert, Bort. Oh, come on, Bort? Mommy, Bobby, buy me a license plate. No, come along, Bort. Are you talking to me? No, my son is also named Bort. Mop and bucket man to the exit of the nauseator. We have another jumper in the roof of TGI McScratchies. We need more Bort license plates in the gift shop. I repeat, we are sold out of Bort license plates. Mayor Quimby supports revolving door prisons. Mayor Quimby even released Sideshow Bob, a man twice convicted of attempted murder. Can you trust a man like Mayor Quimby? Vote Sideshow Bob for mayor. <laughs> Children, that was our only ball. There'll be no team this year. I don't want anyone to give her a hard time just because she's different. No jokes, no taunting. <laughs> Look, that kid's got bosoms. Who's got a wet toe? <laughs> Come here, you butterball. <laughs> don't make me run. I'm full of chocolate. <laughs> and now, to honor America, here's Krusty the Clown. Oh, say, can you see? It's the rarest gummy of them all. It's the gummy Venus de Milo. See you in hell, Candy Boys! <gasps> Precious Venus. Thank you! Somebody had to take the babysitter home. Then I noticed she was sitting on the gummy Venus, so I grabbed it off her. Oh, just thinking about that sweet, sweet candy. Oh, I just wish I had another one right now. She was a university honors student who devoted her life to kids. Until the night a grossly overweight pervert named Homer Simpson gave her a crash course in depravity. Somebody had to take the babysitter home. Then I noticed she was sitting on her sweet can. I grabbed her sweet can. Oh, just thinking about her can. I just wish I had her sweet, 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 sweet can. No, Mr. Simpson, don't take your anger out on me. Get back, get back. M Mr. Simpson, no! Dramatization may not have happened. <laughs> Simpson scandal update. Homer sleeps nude in an oxygen tent, which he believes gives him sexual powers. I don't know Homer Simpson. I, I never met Homer Simpson or had any contact with him, but... <laughs> I I'm sorry, I, I can't go on. <laughs> That's okay. Your tears say more than real evidence ever could. No, Mr. Simpson, a cat is a living creature. I don't care. Now I'm gonna grab me some sweet. No, Mr. Simpson, that's sexual harassment. If you keep it up, I'll yell so loud the whole country will hear. <laughs> With a man in the White House? <laughs> Not likely. <laughs> See, I think about weird stuff. Like, what would happen if E.T. and Mr. T. had a baby? <laughs> well, you'd get Mr. E.T., wouldn't you? And, you know, I think he'd sound a little something like this. I pity the fool who doesn't phone home. Hmm. I, I doubt very highly that one elixir could boast so many fantastic properties. What <laughs> say we amscray out of here and have a wild wing ding at the cyclotron, Doctor? Anything you say, Professor. Ugh. Farm went bust after the cows started giving sour milk. Something must have spooked them good. Simpson 10, terrorist 8. Homer, tell the story right. Okay. Don't! 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 Yeah. Did you have 
to be so graphic? I'm gonna make it after all. <laughs> so, what do you think of the Lady Krusty mustache removal system now, Angelique? It's terrific, Johnny Unitas. But is my upper lip supposed to bleed like this? Probably. <laughs> steady, steady. <laughs> This is the happiest day of my life. Uh -huh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Got it! No shock for me! <laughs> oh, yeah! Let me get this straight. You took all the money you made franchising your name and bid it against the Harlem Globetrotters? Uh, I thought the generals were due. He's spinning the ball on his finger. Just take it. Take the ball. Please do repeat again, and I will translate in for the El Presidente. Which way does the water turn in your toilet? <gasps> Dice que el curso está cambiando. <gasps> Ay, caramba. Los insurgentes ya van a capturar la capital. Necesito a huir. In the past, I've brought you such classic films as Homer in the Shower and Homer on the Toilet. And now I give you The Eternal Struggle. <laughs> Relax, fit my Aunt Fanny. Stupid duckers. Oh, the belt is buckled. <laughs> Did you ever notice how men always leave the toilet seat up? That's the joke. You suck, McBain! Well, I won the belting contest at work. <laughs> Very nice, Homer. Well, Camus can do, but Sartre is Smartre. <laughs> so original. <laughs> How droll. Yeah, well, Scooby-Doo can do-do, but Jimmy Carter is smarter. Uh, stop! Uh, stop! Uh, stop! Mm. Stop! Don't! Ooh! Don't! This time. Don't! The PTA has disbanded! <laughs> no, no, the PTA has not disbanded! the beer supply. After this case and the other case, there's only one case left. Yeah, yeah. Our Barney's right. Yeah, let's get some more beer. Yeah. Hey, what about some beer? Yeah, Barney's right. Stop wearing your backpack over one shoulder. We invented that. Copycats. Uh, you copied us. Step over this line and say that. I'll kick your butt. We had Nintendo. Okay, here's how it goes. I'm a leader. Milhouse is my loyal sidekick. Nelson's a tough guy. Martin's a smart guy, and Todd's the quiet religious guy who ends up going crazy. Chocolate microscopes? You know those guitars that are like double guitars, you know? More rubber stamps. Okay, sir, you're free to go. Good, because I got a hot date tonight. Odd date. Dinner with Fred. Dinner alone. Watching TV alone. All right. I'm going to sit at home and ogle the ladies in the Victoria's Secret catalog. See his catalog. Up and at him. Up and at them. 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 Better. Please. 
the goggles do nothing. Looks like we're in trouble, Fallout Boy. Jiminy Jellicers, radioactive man! We'll have to fight our way out. Are you ready? Yes. Before I can return your children, you'll have to complete a course called Family Skills. It teaches parents to listen to their... Communication, gotcha. But it's important listen, to... Listen, yes, I know. But there's more to it than... I have listening skills. Mr. Simpson, would you please... Shut up, Judge. So long, so long. Here's Jose Flanders. Buenos ding dong dilly dia, senor. And this is Lord Thistlewick Flanders. Charmed. Eh, uh, a googly doogly. <laughs> Cartoons don't have messages, Lisa. They're just a bunch of hilarious stuff, you know, like people getting hurt and stuff, stuff like that. Don't kid yourself, Jimmy. If a cow ever got the chance, he'd eat you and everyone you care about. You know, Smithers, I think I'll donate a million dollars to the local orphanage. When pigs fly... That's a good one. Marge, tell Bart I just want to drink a nice glass of syrup like I do every morning. Tell him yourself you're ignoring Lisa, not Bart. Bart, thank your mother for pointing that out. Homer, you're not not talking to me. And secondly, I heard what you said. Lisa, tell your mother to get off my case. Uh, Dad, Lisa's the one you're not talking to. Bart, go to your room! Wow, Paul McCartney. I read about you in history class. But where's your wife, Linda? Right here, Lisa. Whenever we're in Springfield, we like to hang out in Apu's garden in the shade. We met him in India years ago during the Maharishi days. I'm Sergeant Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club man. I hope I will enjoy my show. Lisa! This is the worst place yet. Oh, oh my God, look at that. Oh, when I grow up, I want to be a lardo on workman's comp, just like Dad. I wash myself with a rag on a stick. I gotta call the plant and warn him. The fingers you have used to dial are too fat. I heard your dad went into a restaurant and ate everything in the restaurant and they had to close the restaurant. Hey, my dad may have gained a little weight, but he's not some kind of food crazed maniac. Uh, uh, oh, the raspberry. <laughs> so much. Don't do it, son. How's that game gonna help your putting? Just take it! Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it! Hello, Fada. Here I am at Camp Granada. Marge, it's Lisa at Camp Granada. You can do it, Otto. You can do it, Otto. Help each other out. That'll be our motto. You, you can, can do, do it, Otto. Otto. You, you can, can do, do it, Otto. Otto. Make this bear. I give you free gelato. Then back to my place, where I will get your blood out. Domo Arigato. Mr. Roboto. <laughs> God boy couldn't get a strike. <laughs> it's me, Ned. <laughs> These 
these uniforms suck. Bart, why do you pick up words like that? Yeah, Mo, that team sure did suck last night. They just plain sucked. I've seen teams suck before, but they were the suckiest bunch of sucks that ever sucked. Homer, watch your mouth. Uh, I gotta go. My damn wiener kids are listening. Spend some dough at table three. Did your Secret Service goons ever whack anybody, George? You know, in my day, little boys didn't call their elders by their first names. Yeah, well, welcome to the 20th century, George. I'll kick you right out of the 20th century, you little... Pay to the order of... Lisa? One cent. And no cents. And now the old John Hancock. Here you go. Thank you. I can't divulge information about that customer's secret illegal account. Oh, crap. I shouldn't have said it was a customer. Oh, crap. I shouldn't have said it was a secret. Oh, crap. I certainly shouldn't have said it was illegal. Ah, it's too hot today. But yes, yes, sir. Now get cracking on my long division and don't forget to show your work, Simpson. I'll have it on your desk in the morning, sir. Bart, leave Simpson alone. Simpson, I need a ride to the library. Yeah, I need someone to help me with the midnight beer delivery. Uh, your job is to distract Barney until it's safely off the truck. Oh, my God! Beer delivery, just sign here. Uh, oh, no, it's you! Oh, 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 hey! Oh, boy! Give me that! Oh. Uh, Wilt thou grant me thine dainty hoof in marriage? Oh, Troy. I will. Just a second, baby. Mm. The comic book store is still open. Save our seats. Will do. Hello. Oh. Mom, you're blocking the TV. If you need something to do, you can fill out my form. Here. Parents' occupation. Please note, homemaker is not allowed as it is not real work. That's why you don't get paid for it. Mm. I am a freakazoid. Come on and wind me up. I am hot. Let us get out of here. Don't worry. I'll tell everybody you are untouchable. <laughs> Do you find something comical about my appearance when I'm driving my automobile? Yeah. <clears throat> now, march. Hey, everybody, look at this. It's that boy who laughs at everyone. Let's laugh at him. <laughs> Thank you very much. Who is playing with the London Symphony Orchestra? Come on, people, somebody order the London Symphony Orchestra. Possibly while high. Cypress Hill, I'm looking in your direction. Now this I like. John Wilkes Booth entered drew his gun, and... Well, that's it. Have a nice summer, everyone. But what happened in Ford's theater? Was President Lincoln okay? He was fine. Go home, Ralph. Like, you know, whatever. Like, you know, whatever. Hey, what's happening? Okay, okay, okay. Not your fault. It's a bird thing. If you don't control the birds, you will someday, but not now. Come on, Homer. Open the door for your mystery date. <gasps> Ooh, captain of the football team. He's a dreamboat. Don't wait up, Marge. <laughs> okay, Bart, your turn, your turn. <laughs> you got the dud! <laughs> He looks just like you, Poindexter. <laughs> mm, let me have one of those porno magazines. Large box of condoms, a bottle of old Harper, a couple of those panty shields, and some illegal fireworks, and one of those disposable enemas. Uh, no, make it two. 
My apologies, sir, but the sale of fireworks is prohibited in this state and is punishable by a... Follow me. Pretty cool your mom to let us hang out here. Totally. Not like my mom. As she'd be butting in with Rice Krispie squares and Tang. Don't! <laughs> the beer! <laughs> As a young boy, I dreamed of being a baseball. But tonight I say, we must move forward, not backward, upward, not forward, and always twirling, twirling, twirling towards freedom. Would you mind hanging my coat up on the wall, please? Mm-hmm. Um, uh, let's see, um, uh, well, well. <laughs> Relax, Homer and Globex, we don't believe in walls. Matter of fact, I didn't even give you my coat. Hmm? <laughs> you got a fresh sound. It'll play well at this school. Hey, Bart, do you have a best friend yet? Because I've been looking for someone to boss me around. Look, lady, I'm supposed to be in the fourth grade. Sounds to me like someone's got a case of the Sposedas. Hmm. Warren! <clears throat> okay. Let's see the right. <laughs> Just a second. When you're ready. All right. Ready. Wait a minute. All right. Wait a minute. Just a second. <sighs> okay, Homer, he's tired. He's tired. Now's your chance. Nudge him. Nudge him. <sighs> Society put Dredrick Tatum away for his brutal crime, but he's paid his debt, and now he's going to get revenge on Homer Simpson. Yeah! Renier Wolfcastle! Ladies and gentlemen, the Fan Man! Ah, oh, cripes. Now I gotta comb this side over. Uh, let's get ready to rumble! Oh, this guy's got more bread than a prison meatloaf. He's rich, I tell you. i never seen a place with a walk-in mailbox. Hey, who am I talking to? This must be the son I've heard so much about. Larry, you must meet our daughter, the debutante. She came out last spring. Whoa, put her back in. She's not done yet. But seriously, I'd love to have hair like yours. I just can't get the zoning permits. Hey, that reminds me, Mom. Buckingham Palace called. They want their hat back. Mm. Hey, kids, how about a hand for your mom? She's all right. Yeah, Mom! Yeah. Mom, Mom! Oh, yeah, thank you. A bloody end for Homer Simpson. It's just one of several possible outcomes, according to our computer simulation. Dad, do I have to brush my teeth? No, but at least rinse your mouth out with soda. Julius! Clancy! Skinner! Seymour! Mother! Patty! Cletus! Oh, uh, Barney! Hey, Lee, check this out. Non-stick coating. <laughs> Hello, I'm Dr. Hibbert. I'm afraid I'm going to have to amputate your butt. <laughs> <laughs> I know you from American Gladiators. You're Pyro. <laughs> Only on weekends. During the week, I'm just your average workaday stuntman. Really? Go ahead. Break a chair on me. <laughs> wow. Thanks. <laughs> oh! 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 
What the hell is wrong with you? Would you do me a favor? When you get back to class, just give him this note. Guess who likes you? Bart didn't do anything. <gasps> do I hear the sound of butting in? It's gotta be little Lisa Simpson. Springfield's answer to a question no one asked. And as for you, I don't know you, but I'm sure you're a jerk. Hey, I've only been here a few minutes. What's going on? Homer, you are the worst human being I have ever met. Hey, I got off pretty easy. Oh. He said he carved it himself from a bigger spoon. Grown deep in the jungle primeval by the inmates of a Guatemalan insane asylum. What can I do? Diddly do, diddly do, diddly diddly do, diddly do, diddly 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 is that the mind is always chattering away with a thousand thoughts at once. Yeah, that's me, all right. Thank God it's Friday. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Hall of Famer Whitey Ford now on the field, pleading with the crowd for... For some kind of sanity. Uh-oh, in a barrage of pretzels now knocking Whitey unconscious. Wow, this is a... Uh, this is a black day for baseball. Oh, yes, sitting. The great leveler from the mightiest pharaoh to the lowliest peasant. Who doesn't enjoy a good sit? Oh, man, you are so right. Did you ever sit like this? Yes, yes, that's it. Oh, I could go for one of those right now. Ah. I'd like to talk about a subject that is very important to me. The Boy Scouts of America have molded men for over a hundred years. And what are you? Oh, um, how's your wife, Nancy? Betty. Who cares? And to pay for it? I'll give up the Civil War Recreation Society I love so much. Well, Homer's out. We gotta find the new General Ambrose Burnside. And I'm not too crazy about our Stonewall Jackson. The South shall come again. Teach us songs and magic tricks. Might I add, no fat chicks. You kids don't know what you want. That's why you're still kids, because you're stupid. Just tell me what's wrong What the freaking show. <laughs> hey, they're having open casting for the voice of Poochie. You should try out, Dad. You have a funny voice. I do not. Haven't you ever listened to yourself on a tape recorder? I prefer to listen to Cheap Trick. Well, here, say something. Hey, this is Homer Simpson saying howdy to all the girls out there in Radio Land. <laughs> hey, this is Homer Simpson saying... <laughs> Pimento nose, and voila! Mommy's patented Happy Cracker snack platter. I once was lost, but now am found. Was blind, but now I see. Well, that was lovely, Robert. You'll be supervising the construction crew. Oh, great. Whenever a woman passes by, I suppose it will be my job to lead the hooting. Oh, yeah. Shake it, madam. Capital knockers. I'm going to look for the kids. Ah! I think I wet my bed. Oh, I love this pedestrian mall. It's practically no traffic. I don't think we should be driving here. The mayor's yelling at us. Stop, you idiot! Yeah, excuse me, little lady. Wheelbarrow line is over there. <laughs> oh, loneliness and cheeseburgers are a dangerous mix. Jesus, 
looks bad. Better turn on the all wiggum charm. Ha 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 Besides, he's only breaking a silly 200-year-old law. It is silly, Marge. And look at all the money I'm making. Ooh. Mom, prohibition may be unpopular, but it's the law, and we still have... Go to your room, room, Lisa. Lisa. You're out there somewhere, Beer Baron, and I'll find you. No, you won't. Yes, I will. Won't. Hold it. This machine is two centuries old. Better test it first. No. Okay, go ahead. Mrs. Krabappel and Principal Skinner were in the closet making babies, and I saw one of the babies, and the baby looked at me. Baby looked at you? I don't think we're talking about love here. We're talking about S-E-X in front of the C-H-I-L-D-R-E-N. Sex cauldron? I thought they closed that place down. Uh, oh, excuse me, could you tell me where I might find the Burns ooze? Sorry, Pops, they don't put nobody's on cereal boxes. Hmm. Yeah. I suppose this one looks a bit like me. Ketchup. 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 God, he eats like a pig. I don't know. Pigs tend to chew. I'd say he eats more like a duck. I'm sorry, isn't that... Yeah, that's me, all right. And the guy standing next to me is President Gerald Ford. And this is when I was on tour with the Smashing Pumpkins. Oh, and here's a picture of me in outer space. You. Went into outer space. You. Sure. You've never been? And what do you have to show for your lifetime of sloth and ignorance? What? Everything! A dream house, two cars, a beautiful wife, a son who owns a factory, fancy clothes, and lobsters for dinner! You're a fraud. A, a total fraud. It was nice meeting you. Good morning, fellow employee. You'll notice that I am now a model worker. We should continue this conversation later during a designated break period. Sincerely, Homer Simpson. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, God. And this racing stripe here, I feel, is pretty sharp. Agreed. First prize. What? Way to go, Homer. You're number one, Homer. But it, it, this was a contest for children. Yeah, and Homer beat their brains out. Well, I don't need safety gloves because I'm Homer Sip. Frank Grimes, or grimy as he liked to be called, taught us that a man can triumph over adversity. I'm sure he's looking down from him right now. Getting up. Change the channel, Marge! <laughs> That's our homework! <laughs> By 1964, experts say man will have established 12 colonies on the moon, ideal for family vacations. Once there, You'll weigh only a small percentage of what you weigh on Earth. Slow down, Tubby. You're not on the moon yet. Testing. Testing. a jail for children. No jail can hold me. Get me! 
Harry Kaputnik and Phone Bone. I want to see their drawings for the new kids on the Blick. And where's my Verschlugger and Pastrami sandwiches? Why don't you lead us, son? Hey, America, you're so fine. You're so fine, you blow my mind. America. <laughs> Hello, beautiful. In your dreams. We'll see about that. Hello, beautiful. It's a shame what school can do. For no reason, here's a poo. Those worms are dead. That's damn fine coffee you got here in Twin Peaks. And damn good cherry pie. Uh. Mrs. Simpson, physically, your son is as sound as a dollar. I'm afraid Bart's severe emotional dysfunction stems from a deep-seated psychological trauma. <laughs> Sorry, I don't have anything to offer you unless you're a member of a minority group. Excelente! Muchas gracias, senorita. Sorry. Ah, uh, so. Everyone's gone! <gasps> Little Bart! <laughs> Little Lisa! <laughs> Little Marge! And the rest. I wonder what my life would be like if I robbed the Quickie Mart. I'll do it. I'll rob the Quickie Mart. All right, put your... Don't! I'll put the safety on. Oops. Guess it was already on. Uh, I... Better just put it down. No offense, Bomb, but that was pretty cool. We can wait. <sighs> Come to Papa. It's clobbering time. Whoa. Oh. Flanders! What? Flanders! I'll scratch you. The hair! The hair! Slut! Loser! Skag! 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 Can I ask you about your dot? What would you like to know? What's the deal with that dot? Yeah, can you see out of it? Does it change colors when you're ticked off? You tell me. Nothing yet. These prestigious wrought iron security gates are bulletproof, bomb-proof, and battering ram resistant. Now. Then what happened to Johnny D? He forgot to lock them. Now. What am I bed? One kilo. So. Ay, 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 my gates. Ay, Johnny C gave me those. Stop! That's my car! <coughs> hey, that smells like regular! She needs premium, dude! Premium! Dude! The home buyer's course said always look inside the house before buying. Well, there it is. Please don't tell anyone how I live. Folks, any words for the Christmas thief, if he's watching? Uh, yes. Kent, uh, hello, jerk. We may never find you, and we should probably all stop looking. But one thing's for sure, you do exist. Nobody move, or I'll blow your heads off. Fishing! No, 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 fishing. The exports of Libya are numerous in amount. One thing they export is corn, or as the Indians call it, maize. Another famous Indian was Crazy Horse. In conclusion, Libya is a land of contrast. Thank you. Go apple! Go orange! Go banana! How are they, Ralph? 
good? They taste like burning. Oh, so, oh, so. Me like how the fly lice. Me flap a dicky wrong time. Then you got these lady comics talking about stuff that would embarrass Red Fox. God rest his smutty soul. Who they slept with. What time they sit on the can. This is supposed to get you a husband? <laughs> can you narrow? Hey, hey! Mr. President, your welfare proposal is nothing but a lot of technical jargon and partisan rhetoric and... <laughs> Mr. President! <laughs> That's what you get for not hailing to the chimp. Brilliant, brilliant. OK, let's do another. But this time, try to look scarier. Kind of like... Brown. <laughs> gorgeous, gorgeous, right. baby. That's it, that's it. You know, fingerprints are just like snowflakes. They're both very pretty. You take a dash of Dad, a pinch of Mom, then we bake for nine months and... Mmm, that's good, Billy. Mr. McClure, what does DNA stand for? By gum, it worked. I've awakened in the future. Moon pie. What a time to be alive. We're losing power. We're losing backup power. We're down to mood lighting here. They call her the cat lady. People say she's crazy just because she has a few dozen cats. But can anyone who loves animals that much really be crazy? <laughs> the old Union Pacific doesn't come by here much anymore. Mojo, what have they done to you? Pray for Mojo. They won't stop me from delivering these Unisat pennies. <laughs> Go, pennies! Help the puny children who need you. <laughs> I surrender! Not so fast. There's my kite doing, Smithies. Oh, it's uh, soaring majestically, sir. You're it! We'll see about that. After him, Smithies! Ah, you're not it! Game? What's a game? Oh, <laughs> a game. Push huh? harder. <laughs> Go past the max. Reach over the top. Master your ass. I only eat food in bar form. When you concentrate food, you unleash its awesome power, I'm told. That's why I'm compressing five pounds of spaghetti into one handy mouth-sized bar. Hmm. Hospital, please. So, uh, ain't you guys gonna ask me about my hat? Mm. Hey, Carl. What's with the hat? Well, what, this thing? I got it down at the museum. It's what the ancient Egyptians call a souvenir. Ha ha! Ha ha! No, thanks. Ma no, Homer wasn't a great man, nor even an adequate man. And he certainly never accomplished anything. Uh, President Lanny, you have anything to say? Nah. 
All right, fair enough. Toss him in the hole, boys. Remember when you almost became heavyweight champ? No. Finish him! Finish him! Yes! A Maggie Oop! This is genuine human hair. This is legal, right? Yeah, sure, whatever. These drugs will make the operation seem like a beautiful <laughs> dream. <laughs> ah. Hi, everybody. Oh, 4 a.m. No, I'll never get back to... <laughs> Magilla, gorilla, gorilla for sale. Hey, you should not want to take my banana, Mr. Peebles. <laughs> oh, my God. My middle name is right behind that shrub. I'll finally know what J stands for. From this moment forth, I will be known as Homer J. Simpson. The ocean abounds with fearsome creatures, but none attacks its prey with more fury than the seaweed shark. The struggle is soon over. And for the first time ever, our computer lab actually has a computer in it. Super Nintendo Chalmers? Meow. I'm learning. Whoa. Woo! Hello, sweet cheek. Just remember, you represent the office of the mayor, so always comport yourself in a manner befitting. Quick, honk at that broad. Good work, Simpson. I couldn't be happier with the way that went. Now, if you'll excuse me, my fondue is just about... spaghetti a hose <laughs> Oh, man. Uh-oh. Here comes Lorne Michaels. Pretend you don't see him. Ah, Max Power. Trent said I absolutely must meet you. This is fabulous. Anyway, Marge, uh, how do you feel about the economy? Please come in. Maggie smells bad, and the cat wants something, but I don't know what. I'm almost done. And tell Bart to get out of my purse. I sentence you to kiss my ass. Hey, anybody seen Homer today? There he goes. Oh, ee, oh, uh, uh, ding, ding, well, well, a bing, bing. Oh, ee, oh, uh, uh, well, a bing, bing, ding, ding, do. I'll start by turning the knob. <laughs> gotcha, Miss. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Does it get any better than this? Not to me, Dad. Well, there is one steak that's only available by special request. Uh, we call it uh, sirloin a lot. It's uh, the size of a boogie board. Ooh, I'll have that one. And to drink? Meatballs. Very good, sir. Take my advice. This one's not for greenhorns. Greenhorns? Who's a greenhorn? What's a greenhorn? It's an insult. Suck him, Dad. Suck everybody. Oh, humans are so ridiculous. He's not even halfway through Walter, and he's already hallucinating. <laughs> <laughs> oh, lousy drunks. I'll show them. We'll just have to wait until someone comes. Anyone? Anyone at all? Oh, Millhouse is selling seeds, and he's coming this way. Oh, the birds got him. <laughs> oh, oh, not the seeds! Get that truck out of here! Are you kidding? You mean it ate Patrick too? It ate everybody. What about Erica? 
It, it ate, ate everybody, everybody, stupid. Or if you're not into chicken. No, no, I'm into chicken. How about wild boar? Or swordfish? Or hippo? Mmm, hippo. <laughs> How's your father's project coming along? I think he's almost done. Dad, chew with your mouth closed. You're losing your mystique. Lisa, all great artists love free food. Check out Jasper John's. You squeal on me, I'll kill you. What the? What the? Hey! You're mean! B3! You suck my battleship. <laughs> G52! You suck my battleship. <laughs> don't you want to be free like the eagle? Oh, I don't live here. I'm just dropping off Indian casino pamphlets. Vote yes on Prop 217. You know the door was open, Chief Break Everything. Damn the torpedoes! What'd he say? Put on our tuxedos. I want some taquitos. No more nap time, no more bingo. You can do whatever you want. Let's play bingo! Okay, yeah, let's yes, play bingo! Yes, yes. You suck my battleship. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that Homer on the Japanese channel? If that's Homer, then who the hell's been putting beers on his tab? So, woohoo! Um, that boy ain't right. Don't stop thinking about tomorrow. Don't stop. We'll soon be here. Check it out, Dad. You can print out the headline from the day you were born. Ooh, pointless nostalgia. I like pizza. I like bagels. I like hot dogs with mustard and beer. I get the picture. I'll eat a plant. I could even eat a baby deer. La 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 la. Who's a baby deer on the lawn? Enough there. already. Sorry. No one shared you for years. <laughs> All right, almost done, my little friend. Soon you'll be a nice, cool. Hey, Lenny, you said it's about going male? You know it. I'll probably say something tomorrow. I hear that. A cooling tank just blew, and they're taking Lenny to the hospital. Oh, no, not Lenny. Not Lenny. <laughs> hey, Carl, check out the overhead scoreboard. <laughs> <laughs> Poo. Kent Brockman live from Barney's Volorama where local pinhead Homer Simpson is on the verge of a perfect game. Hey, there was no accident at the plant. Dad just wanted to go bowling. He shouldn't have deceived me, but I'm just so relieved when he's okay. Wait up, guys. I gotta empty my grass bag. Get away from my store, you young hoodlums. And what if we do, Paps? He's got a broom! Get out of here! Get the pennies! Go! Go! <laughs> I don't understand. I could swear it was right here. Yeah, right, Mop Top. And I'm Ed Sullivan. <clears throat> really big shoe. No, no, I can do it better. Really big shoe. Really big. That's it. I'm so soft and cuddly. With lots of firepower! Ha-ha! Funzo! 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 If you don't have Funzo, you're nothing. Yeah! Ha! Ugh! Ha! I'm sorry, Gary. There's no longer a place for you here. What you talking about, Miss Nagel? That is so adorable. You're rehired. Sucker. I knew exactly what she was talking about. <laughs> Come on! That suit's a little revealing, isn't it? Well, it allows for maximum mobility. Feels like I'm wearing nothing at all. If you ever get into trouble, all you need to do is... Feels like I'm wearing nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. <laughs> Stupid sexy flander. <laughs> He's kicking it old school! Operator, get me Thailand! 
T I and so on. Hmm, that's terrific, Duncan. You're ten for ten. Now let's look in the rule book and see if horses can play in the NFL. Oh! Just yesterday, a poo was a lonely bachelor. <laughs> Just thank God those days are over. And the Van Houtens were enjoying a storybook marriage. Yeah, lots of storybooks have witches. Shut up, Kirk. Sorry. And the next 20 callers will get this album of museum noises. Now your music room can sound just like the Metropolitan Museum in New York. <coughs> Outstanding. Mm, I can see the house is falling apart without me. So here's the new order. Bart? You're the man of the house. Mm. Lisa, I'm promoting you to boy. Mm. Maggie's now the brainy girl. Toaster can fill in for Maggie. And Marge, you're a consultant. Mm. Oh, who am I kidding? The truth is I'm no missionary. I work in a nuclear power plant. Ooh, tell us all you know about nuclear power. Well, I'm off to market. Uh. Marge, you're making a complete fool of your... Oh, with just Barney. Oh, he'll never dance with her. She'll have to settle for some Mexican mill house. I shall dance. With her. Que malo. Once again, I must sugar my own churro. Got a brother named Billy, and my teeth look silly. Break it down now. Word on the street as you dumped Dawson. He's history, Jenda. Wait till he sees me with that new exchange student. Hola, Harmony. Now some unpleasant news. I have learned that someone in this room is a squealer. We've narrowed it down to either Johnny Kitelips or Frankie the Squealer. Okay, it's me. I can't help it. I just like squealing. It makes me feel big. I said I was sorry. Oh, All right, okay. fair enough. Class act. Sorry you're such jerks. <laughs> and now, Branford Marcellus will play using Lisa's very own saxophone. Don't touch it! They can clone her from the spit! <laughs> Good luck, Millhouse. Blue Spanish eyes. Teardrops are falling from your Spanish eyes. Maybe we should talk to a financial planner. Financial panther, eh? Mr. Simpson, you're a dollar overdrawn. Get him, Sheba! <laughs> <gasps> Marge, your posture looks terrible. I'd like my fee, please. Hey. I know you're not a deaf mute, Mr. Simpson. We've been talking for the last 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> wow, i never seen you have so many lunch beers before, Homer. Oh, I concur. Word of day calendar. Is this enough dirty, dirty money? Mm. <laughs> Why, it most certainly is. Uh, Mr. Costington, something quite wonderful has happened. Oh, uh, no. Oh, uh, no. Uh, yes. Rusty the Clown. Ah, Springfield gets the lamest balloons. Are you kidding? There's Funky Winkerbean. Over here, Funky. <gasps> Look, it's a Noid. Avoid the Noid. He ruins pizzas. Ooh, a dancing Jesus. Dee, 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 dee. Here it is, everybody. The world's greatest website. We could remove the crayon for you. It could vastly increase your brain power. Or it could possibly kill you. Hmm. Increase my killing power, eh? Let's do it. Question! Yes, Nelson. A moron says what? Not being a moron, I wouldn't know. However, medium. What? Ladies and gentlemen, I give you your moron. Mm. Homer's the guy who rigged up my pants with this special codpiece. 
comfy, isn't it? Oh, yeah. It provides the freedom and protection I so sorely need. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> if it doesn't fit, you must acquit. Therefore, I shall resign the presidency. And one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Is uh, the manager here? Well, I'm kind of the co-manager. Tough break, toots. I need a man who answers to no one. A full manager. Hachi machi. I really hate to be a snitch. Don't worry. Your yellow-bellied ratting will be held in the strictest confidence. <sighs> well, in that case... My neighbor Homer released a radioactive ape in my house. It's, uh, it's taken over the whole top floor. <laughs> Look, if you want me to turn, just point. That cow! <laughs> it's one way! Are you here to make a bust of some kind? No, we're just, uh, checking to make sure you're having a crime-free morning. <laughs> As far as I know. Hey, you know what would be a real crime? What's that, Lou? Uh, letting that tennis court go to waste. Would you boys like to play tennis? Why, yes. Yes, we would. Uh-oh. You know, this is such a beautiful day. I don't know why we don't operate outside more often. Time of death, 1015. <laughs> uh, take that. You knocked his block off! Come with me. Well, let me get this straight, Mr. Duff. The isotopes are not moving to Albuquerque? Absolutely not. So, are you calling Homer Simpson a liar? Well, we have obtained this footage of him with his pants on fire. Don't support a team run by liars. Liars? They're secretly planning to move to Albuquerque. That's crazy! It would have been on a talk radio show like Sports Chat or Sportzilla and the Jabber Jocks. Yeah! Oh, you little... Ah! New feelings brewing in Duff Man. What would Jesus do? Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah! And now the Estrogen Network presents Afternoon Yak. Man. Yeah! Cancelled. When do we get to see the animals? In the morning, little one. Now, good night, and don't let the bed bugs paralyze. Homie, did you remember to tip Katanga? No, he did not. Abracathumbra. Ha, ha, ha. Gang, you can be one of them TV magic queers. Now you see me, now you don't. <laughs> It's just like my dream. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. Let's see. You will invent a humorous toilet lid. You will find true love on Flag Day. Your store is being robbed, Apu. Are you getting all this, Lisa? I don't know. So I foreclosed on her mortgage and took her cats. <laughs> <laughs> Great heavens! It's one of those nude female fire stations. Oh, I'd always be second place to some kitten stuck in a tree. Let's go, Smithers. Smithers? Ah! 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 You're a nice guy, Monty. You're always laughing and denting your fingers. I like that. <laughs> Excellent. And you're so upbeat. You think everything's excellent. Mr. Sandman! Bring me a dream. Bum, 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 bum. Make him the cutest that I've ever seen. Look, Gabriel, we're learning to work together. That's great, but so are the wolves and cougars. Hey. <laughs> Uh-oh. You know, tomorrow is the annual Springfield formal event. 
We weren't going to go after last year's unpleasantness. That donkey is such a bad influence on you. Five o'clock? I better get home for dinner. Well, come back anytime, partner. To the laundry room. <laughs> there we are. Is this the Dairy Queen? <laughs> Joan of Arc, you were accused of heresy, witchcraft, and that man told me you pushed him. <laughs> It's the giant statue of Christ on Corcovado. Wow. It's like he's on the dashboard of the entire country. Look, the room came with a fruit hat. Hey, and a mini bar hat. I'm Chiquita Banana, and I'm here to say... I will eat this Toblerone, and I will not pay. Look at Chimp. He is so high. <laughs> hey, Chimp is hemp. Spill backwards. And Otto is... Auto backwards! <laughs> now I'm scared. Tonight, when dinosaurs get drunk. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've been there, man. What does he want now? If he wants to sleep with us, forget it. I'll kill you, other people! I will kill you, too! You want some cornbread, Mr. Jingles? <laughs> well, you can forget it. Because I'm gonna kill you! All right, I've come up with a composite sketch of my prime suspect. Behold! Dad, that's Bart. Exactly. Look at him over there, eating that apple. What's he planning? What? Go! All right, Fat Tony, your little game is over. Hey, how'd you find us? One of these ferrets is wearing a wire. You're not a pet, and you're not a friend. You're nothing to me. <laughs> now, Bob, I know you're concerned, but don't worry. I have operatives working the crowd. So, uh, you're from Tempe? I'm from Chicago. Whoa, I'm so drunk, I'm gonna puke. You ever get that feeling, beautiful? From the widest gully to the deepest trench. Holds define who we are and where we are going. Or consider the dolphin, nature's most filmed creature. Even they have holes, blow holes. Welcome to the electric car of the future, sponsored by the gasoline producers of America. I'm an electric car. I can't go very fast or very far. And if you drive me, people will think you're gay. One of us. One of us. <coughs> Rainier Wolf Castle. My ex-boyfriend. Sarah leaps and take me back. If tears could burst through my muscular ducts, I would cry like a baby who was just hit by Hannah. Where's everybody? No one usually shows up unless there's a vote. Well, then why are you here? I steal stuff when everyone's gone. <coughs> my Christmas shopping's done. <laughs> I wouldn't go to jail. The legal owner of this plant would. Canary M. Burns. <gasps> <gasps> this entire plant is in his name. Uh oh, sounds like some bad eggs are cooking up trouble. Mm, bad eggs. <laughs> I'll be batting 352 in the majors. Uh, 
Yes! Oh! Puzzle piece, come out and play, yay! Hey, what's this? Marge's memory chest? Oh, Marge saved all this stuff from when we were going out. The fake business card I made up to impress her. That will be $100. I see. <laughs> Dear Die Hard, you rock, especially when that guy was on the roof. P.S. Do you know Mad Max? Deal! Hit me, hit me, hit me! Bustin'! <laughs> well, gotta go! See you in heaven! <laughs> Mommy, he's everything you said he was! Lady, you're gorgeous. You make Dame Edna look like a dude! Why, thank you. You're all right, love. Best wishes for a joyous holiday season. Now, in the spirit of the season, start shopping. And for every dollar of crusty merchandise you buy, I will be nice to a sick kid. For legal purposes, sick kids may include hookers with a cold. <laughs> now, back to the year Santa got lost. Starring Jimmy Stewart as the voice of Mr. Mailman. Santa was in an awful pickle. Beatniks had given drugs to the reindeer, and uh, they were no darn good. So Santa placed a call to Secretary of Defense Melvin Laird. This just in, Santa Claus is dead. <coughs> or he might as well be, because there's an even fatter man who's holding families at nice point. Homer Simpson, seen here in this retouched photo. Pathetic Flanders, thinking he can buy people's love with thoughtful gifts. Cool, Mr. Flanders gave me a crusty brand operation game. Oh, you just tweezered my wang. You're a double bacon genius burger. And just a little drunk. Let's just say that on this day, a million years ago, a dude was born who most of us think was magic. But others don't, and that's cool. But we're probably right. Amen. Amen. God and sinners reconciled. Today is the birthday of our Lord Jesus Christ. Then how would we ever get to see Camelot? We'll merely watch the movie on tape. Is that better? To me, Ralph Wiggum is Sir Lancelot. If ever I would leave you, it wouldn't be in summer! Boo! Hostess Twinkies? I heard if you age them for ten years, they turn to liquor. Kids, go ride bikes for a while, huh? Yeah, you heard your mother. Mr. Bojangles, Mr. Bojangles, we're all Bojangles, who killed Bojangles, maybe it was you. <laughs> this dermal magnifier will show the extent of the damage. So, juveniles who know how to foxtrot are 10% less likely to commit a double homicide. Who conducted this study? The Institute of Shut Your Fat Face. Homie, you know I'm usually good for a triple X throwdown, but between those kids and going to Uncle Tyrone's, we can't be alone. We're alone now. You're never alone in this crap shack. Well, you little... <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Promiscuous Idiots Island on Fox, the home of Promiscuous Idiots. Last week on PII, our billionaire bachelor gave five lovely ladies a rose of continuation. And he hurled a rock of rejection at anyone displaying intelligence, character, or ethnicity. Thank you, Nelson. <laughs> <laughs> Cherry smells, Terry smells, stinky all the way. Sting, 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 one horse open sleigh. Joe, why won't you acknowledge our love child? 
Uh, uh, that is not my baby. Er, uh, where? I'm not gonna grow up. Oh, yes you are. Why, in the right light, you're starting to get your own muzzle. I thought it was chocolate milk. Yeah, that's how it starts. Oh, Danny boy, the pipes, the pipes are calling. For a loan this big, you'll have to put up your house as collateral. Put up my house? But I just paid it off. What would Marge say? Do whatever you have to do to save Moe's. I love my homie. Okay, honey, I'll do it. What's going on here? Nothing, nothing. You can make a woman very happy someday. Wow. For real, Cease? It's true. You'd be quite a catch if you'd just shower and shave and stop swearing under your breath. Aw, oh, thanks, Marge. You know it all, bitch. <laughs> Lisa, could you pass the salad? And it's James with the steel. Super Bowl halftime show. Sponsored by the new Ford pickups, Citibank, and Moe's Tavern. How could you afford this? I hustled a lot of pool. Uh, hey, you want to play? I got to warn you, I ain't that good. <laughs> All right. Sucker. Ah! Who's the sucker now, huh? Bart, do you have anything to say? My sister has no sense of humor. I'm sure you understand. It's why you became a judge instead of finding a husband. I have a husband! What is he, blind and deaf? Just as the end of the day can bring great beauty, so too can the end of menstruation be a time of radiance and celebration. Sure, you may experience mood swings, loss of desire, and private dryness. But don't worry, you can still do everything that you did before. Everything? Including having children? Ma'am, we're trying to make a video here. Something don't feel right. Usually when there's a jailbreak, there's electricity in the air, like the calm before a summer storm. Or uh, right before a heavyweight fight. Mine's more poetic. <coughs> Sorry I'm late, Lisa. I was at the gym totally gunning my lats. Just gunning them. Uh, oh, man. The deposit on this tux was 200 Reagans. Here's what really seals the deal. Yo, 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 slide your queen into the machine and don't expect any change, dog. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. How I wonder what you are. Thank you. Ah, uh, Odi, por vad, fari. Por kutus takam zili. Unyamu aviatur se biatu ayeta. You may inside come. I got five beta cappuccinos for Ned's pre-meds. Flanders! That's odd. I could have sworn I just heard someone shriek my name. You heard nothing! Oh, that's better. This is awesome! Black God rules! Shine on! Oh, let it shine on! <laughs> We tried to break up your parents and we broke up mine. Wanna call my therapist and tell her how you feel? Hello, Dr. Wexler? Stop calling me. I'm on my honeymoon. Yeah, it's that weird kid again. to stay up, but he just couldn't make it. So, what setting is that fan on? Medium. Mm. I would have guessed low. You would have guessed wrong. Bombardment! Bombardment! Walk it off! Bombardment! Bombardment! No! I caught it! I'm safe! Son, are you okay? Uh, I guess. Bombardment! Uh. Yeah. Uh, come yeah. on! Uh. Yeah. Bonnie, how do you keep getting back in? I'm a drunk. I don't know nothing about how I do anything. Uh. 
joust. <laughs> <laughs> Tranquilizer dart. Bart, I told you, no television till you do the dishes. And I do not call that doing the dishes. He has released the bulls from the stadium. Thank God I am up high. Yep. Please, no. I have a wife and three girlfriends. Oh, Dad, we'll miss you so much. I'll miss you kids, too. Attention, India Air Flight 57, now boarding first class, small children and fat guys. It's me. Women are as smart as men. Why, a woman invented liquid paper. Well, you know what a man invented? Actual paper. Well, a woman also invented the windshield wiper. Which goes great with another male invention, the car. Here's me fighting with former President Bush. Me fighting with current President Bush. And here's me showing a bag of apples who's boss. Carpool, Nelson! Just a sec, I gotta finish my science project. Whoa! Squirrels don't like rocks. I'm a cootie eater. I've been one all my life. I like the cooties so much. I have a cootie wife. <laughs> we'll have plenty of food so you won't starve. Oh, thank you! I was talking to the cat. We brought him in by the boatload, day and night. Then one day they... Well, they were gone. Maybe you just overfished them. Maybe they underspawned. Maybe you killed them all. Or maybe the fish killed themselves. Maybe you should be ashamed of yourself. Or maybe you should marry Millhouse. <gasps> yeah, that's right. I know about Millhouse. Well, at least they left your underwear on. That was nice of them. I think the hook is touching my brain. Bobble Poonam Pachawi, package board, baby, bordle, bordle, bordle. Homer wants you to meet my crew. It's my first mate, Billy. Mm. And this is Fausto. Yeah, he just plays with that knife all day and night. It's my thing. Great, man. Now I need a new thing. Are you sure, Captain? The barometer don't lie. All right, now listen. If a storm were coming, my trick knee would be acting up. Dear God. If this works, I'll go faster than any ten-year-old has ever gone. <laughs> Mine has a cup holder! Bart, that's a blowhole! You're a blowhole. <laughs> no, boy. Up, up, up. Now, let's see. 20 minutes at 300 degrees is the equivalent of five minutes at, let's see if you can, 1,200 degrees. Now, to make the folded index card that goes in front of the cake. How about a smooch? Kablooey! Here comes the mouse. What's his name? That was me that done that. But it ain't enough, so here's this. That's what you get for, uh, I don't know, messing with my wife. Roll over, Ann Coulter, and tell James Carville the news. Springfield voters have overwhelmingly rejected the major candidates of both parties in favor of a write-in, eight-year-old Ralph Wiggum. Shockingly, this new face is now favored by 53% of likely voters. A new front runner has been crowned. Compassionate. Tough. Curious. These are all words Ralph Wiggum doesn't know. But he doesn't need to know them. He lives them every day. Homer Simpson. I know a lot of you from church and the market and such, and I'm not much for talking, but it seems to me in hard times like these that we Americans come together. That girl come right there. So, 
I'd say we roll up our sleeves and fake a disaster to trick the federal government out of relief money. Since the dawn of parking lots, man has sought to stuff his guts with food and alcohol in anticipation of watching others exercise. What childbirth is to women, eating trunk meat is to the big winged. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who's a favorite TV clown who likes to clown around? K, are you? S-T-Y. Hey, quit stepping on my solo, you creepy little show monkeys. Hiya. <laughs> hey, he went into a construction site. <gasps> That's a hard hat zone. <laughs> you sure this is safe? Sure, I got my seatbelt on. Bartholomew J. Simpson! <laughs> hey, John Wayne, have you heard about StockSwapper.org's low, low transaction fees? Sounds like quite a deal, Pilgrim. I hate transaction fees. A flash! Ha 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 Red Dog, this is Mustache One. We have possible male-female interaction. Be prepared to terminate inappropriate contact. Ready with the ice water. Lock onto his wiener. We have wiener lock. Lemonade! We want lemonade! Don't worry, folks. Our master chef is stirring up a fresh batch. Must leave quietly. <laughs> Now drive back to the clubhouse and order me a Tom Collins. With a virgin Tom Collins for me? Virgin, what are you, a girl? <laughs> Wanna go to prom with me? Well, I'm engaged to the quarterback, but yes. Mm, forget it, Marge. A girl like you could never land a Homer Simpson. Wonderful job, son. Just stellar. How did I do? 96. What did I get wrong? Several answers. Several? That's more than a few. And almost a bunch. Bart, because of your superior intellect... No, but wait. I aced the math part, right? Yeah, because run, I... Run along now. I'll tell you what I want, what I really, really want. So tell me what you want, what you really, really want. I'll tell you what I want, what I really, really want. So tell me what you want. One question remains. Why did you come here? Because I cleverly deduced the answer to Springfield's biggest ring. Voila. Well, it gives me no pleasure to say your deduction was faulty. <laughs> How'd your day go, Mo? Incredible. I've never felt like this before. It's like my heart wants to do her. Do you know who else was really into rowboats? Jesus. And he could have turned his rowboat into a jet ski, but he didn't. Good guy. I need to rent an apartment in the worst part of Waverly Hills. The crappier, the better. Ah, so cheap, eh? Ah, so cheap eh, to you. At my old school, I got so many A's, the teachers didn't even check my work. Maybe that's why you got so many A's. Oh my god, you've been challenged. Well, Lisa, let's see how you respond. <laughs> Bart Simpson is the ultimate bad boy. Befriend him and you'll wind up just like him. A rebel who does what he wants when he wants. Wow. Come on, tough guy. Let's go. He's so bad. L'école, c'est moi. Oui, c'est toi. Even a Ralph of this school speaks French. Au revoir. Come and get me! I tried to show them the Polaroids. They wouldn't look! It's your job to get their attention. Nobody takes responsibility anymore. Well, I, I just wanted to get back into the business after I had my kids. Yeah, well, now those kids have an embarrassment for a mother. <laughs> Shiny enough to see Skinner's ugly face. No! Come with me. <laughs> What's gotten into you, man? Andrew, I wanted to show you something in the makeout room. Uh, makeup room. I'll be right there in a minute, babe.
Looks like I just bought some property on Boner Way. In all my years of being a judge, I've never seen such a flimsy case. Are you sure? Because we've brought you a lot of flimsy cases. Like that goat we accused of income tax evasion. I still think he was guilty. One boy to go, please. Easy on the freckles. A ten-year-old can't adopt a child. <laughs> oh, you think he's for me. <laughs> you know, the orphan is for my folks. They can't have more kids. It is so sad. A real-life Jaws bit off my dad's wiener. Holy moly! If it's your lucky day, you'd be a fool not to take advantage of it. There's no time! I need you for the wedding toast! My hair! Now let's get that ticket. We ran a subway station? No, the Underground Railroad was a bunch of people who helped slaves escape to Canada. There were no actual trains and it wasn't underground. Then they should have called it the Above Ground Normal Road. Good point, Bart. I have thought of that before. Very good, Bart. You know, Marge, uh, Maud and I had a fight right before she died. Nettie, when you're drying your hands with our monogrammed towels, can you use the NF towel, not the MF? You know, maybe I should use a towel marked BDD, Big Diddly Deal. <gasps> oh, man, you girls ruin everything, even vampires. Hey, vampires are cool outsiders who love girls who hate cheerleaders. No, they're all about chomping neck, and they don't put product in their hair like this loser. Hey, boy. Ah! <laughs> Your mother thinks I'm working on the car. Dad, that is genius, but I need some advice. Oh, no! I thought you were fixing my brakes. <laughs> So, what do you think? I think we're gonna blow it up and let the bleeding heart liberals ask questions later. Well, now, why can't it be blown up by a woman of color? A terrorist plot. Enough radioactivity was released to create 17 hulks and a Spider-Man. Here is an artist's conception. Quite disturbing. That blonde girl thinks she's smart like us dark hairs. Again with the blonde. Why in the world would the color of the hair on someone's head have anything to do with the intelligence within? Yeah, you're so right. I'm smart too. You're leaving with me? Would you rather I bring someone else on the world's most romantic train? Oh, Helen. Mm. Mm. Is that a train in your pocket, or are you just happy to see me? Both. Top to bottom, left to right, reading things is out of sight. Speaking of out of sight, you gotta hide me. I slept with the lighting director's wife, and... Oh! To find an entrepreneur you want to lend to, click on my nose. If you can catch it, it's up here. <laughs> oh, down here. Too slow. <laughs> okay, I'll hold still. No, I won't. <laughs> Got it. Goodbye. <laughs> Come on out, Bertie. Follow the sound of my voice, 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 voice. Come on, just one more drink, Marge. We're going to plant you in Fat Tony's gang as an undercover informant. I can't go undercover with Fat Tony. He's met me. I've been in his house. I was briefly his consigliere, consugli, cannoli, er, Robert Duval. Here's how it goes down. I rough up Louie, then you stand up to me earning his trust. But I haven't earned his trust if it's based on a lie. Enough of your dime store morality. What's a dime store? I... <clears throat> So Bart, the little dickens, was going to set off an explosion to break us up. Can you believe it? <laughs> Actually, we can believe it. What are you talking about? Your son always was the bad apple of the bunch. You know nothing about my son, and even less about apples. Oh, so what do you think? She wants an honest answer. What do we do? I don't know. I don't know! We could fake a stroke. The last time we faked a stroke, it led to a real one. We're running out of time, people. We need an answer, and it has to be great! So, chicken. Then the doobie of destiny changed their lives forever when police burned marijuana seized from the Buddy Rich Orchestra in a nearby lot. 
<laughs> so you know, uh, check your barometer, thermometer, anemometer. Why does everything have to have an ometer on it? <laughs> hey, Doc. Where is everybody? I told them not to come. Why didn't you tell me not to come? <laughs> Homer, to emphasize the seriousness of this situation, I'm going to turn my chair around backwards. <gasps> does this mean you like me? Yes. No. I don't know. It means that, that life is full of unexpected things, and you should never give up. And you're cute in the moonlight. <gasps> Everything's coming up, Millhouse! So, uh, where's your husband buried? Probably between the hooters of a coat check girl in Shelbyville. Ha! Oh, boy, that laugh is infectious. Ha! Ha! It's fun. Yeah, give me a kiss, Natty boy. That's right. Kiss all the men that have ever made their way to Edna's adventurous tongue. Including me. I shall be discreet in my tweets, but brutal in my blog. We made love in so many elevators. Whoa, 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 whoa. No leaving until we all spook you on Edna's face. All right, pipe down back there. You'll get your chance. Oh, come on, Mo. Quit hogging her face. Ah! <laughs> <coughs> I'm just a guy who saw what needed to be done and did it. Oh, speaking of which, let's get these eggs back in the jar. <laughs> what the? A quiet, unassuming security guard who foiled a robbery at a local tavern, as seen in this Taiwanese animated dramatization. When the security guard was watching, the security guard Wayne got the robber's eggs out of the jar. That robber took the eggs and took his eggs to eat. Those security guards were too drunk to drink. Hey, what the? 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 Hey, what You'll be studying with me now. Same garbage, different dumpster. Uh, we'll start with American history. Now, I'm sure you know who these gentlemen are. Dollar bill guy, five dollar bill guy, sex guy, Will Ferrell, black guy. <laughs> Two candy. Uh, hello, yes, hello, Miss Wyoming. Uh, I'll have to climb your Grand Tetons another night. <laughs> yeah, the breast joke. I, I, I served it up. Why won't he love me? <laughs> Go away. No kid should see his hero sunk so low. Well, you're not exactly my hero. I see you more as a cautionary tale. What? I'll show you as a cautionary tale. I'll show everybody. Krusty, you're getting the best reviews of your career. Yep, I'm back on top. And this time, I'm not blowing it on cocaine for my horses. They start well, then they get paranoid around the third turn. You are the kind of ill-informed gas bag this network cannot get enough of. We only have 11 now, not to mention our liberal straw man. Oh, the plain and simple facts is, I'd love to raise your taxes and make your children gay. I'm just trying to spare their feelings. Those freaks have no feelings. Even baby never cry. She's a freak! <laughs> what baby does that? Hold it right there. The jerk in the glasses did everything. <laughs> Need inhaler. <gasps> This is the best I'm sorry party Homer's ever thrown. Who the hell are you? Come with me. Hey, the first time we lost Maggie was in this store. Bart, here's my thank you gift. What could a girl have that I... Oh, oh my God, it's just like Dad's. <laughs> hey, this is all about board. 
The three of us are going to the most romantic restaurant in town. This car's so clean. I'm not getting flea bites on my ankles. I have bug bombed the car for my lady. <laughs> That's it. I am off of this stuff. Me too, sweetheart. Kids? Yes, Mama. No exceptions. Nobody likes to be rejected, and it never gets easier until you can drink, because then you can express your unfiltered feelings by drunk dialing. Observe. Hey, it's me again. He's there, isn't he? Well, I hope this doesn't sound weird, but I'm inside your closet. What's the matter, darling? Thanks for asking, Duchess. I'm sitting here waiting for a girl that's never gonna show up. What makes you so sure? Girls don't like me. I don't really like them yet either, but I think I'm gonna. There's a storm a-brewing down there. Uh, the long, slow line to leave the theater forms on the left. <laughs> and we have to walk by a drum circle! Buster Man! Morning! Personage! A theater in the round! <laughs> and... Hey, pile. Oh. <sighs> and the Lord saw what he had made, and it was good! I forgot to feed my jackass! You're welcome! Kids! Oh, no problem, I'll just cut to my clean material. Oh my god, I'm gonna be the farmer's daughter now, like... I don't need a man from Nantucket. No. Bring out the monkey! Oh, dog! Ah! <laughs> Bongo was happy without me. He had become her dog. Oh, homie. I'm so sorry. Well, that's just the way dogs are. The most disloyal, unfaithful creatures God ever made. It's all good, brah. Hey, where's Bart? Oh, uh, well, he wanted to be here, but I'm going to decrease the volume of my voice and mumble so you can't really understand what I'm saying, and I'll just keep doing this until the subject here. All I have left. I trust you completely. And I, you. Let me run your credit card to uh, celebrate that trust. Okay. This should do it. Thank you, Mr. Frandos. Sorry, Maggie. I just don't have the touch today. Uh, uh. Carl Carlson brought that blue tape. You know, that makes you really look like you know what you're doing. You peel it off, and you got that super straight line there. Oh. And when he brings a six-pack to my house, he doesn't take the extras home with him. Carl Carlson leaves them in the fridge. Oh. Maybe sometime we could watch it in the same room. Chat room? Room room. Show's over! Huh. <sighs> that turned out for steamy in a jiff. I can still hear you. Ah! I can still hear you. Ah! It is the climax what everything's been building to. There's a question I must pose. I have something for you. No? Not that. <laughs> mm. <laughs> These are great seats. You can hear the players swear from up here. I'll kick your ass, Millhouse! Pour me another. What are you doing? It's imaginary. Fine. I gotta go. I'll see you later. <coughs> no, 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 Riparto! È una mina della seconda guerra mondiale che farà sortire in aria! Calamari? No! <laughs> no! They smoke, they talk, they smoke and talk and, and smoke. <laughs> smoke, 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 talk, talk, talk. are feeling pretty smug. Skinner! Welcome to our daycare center. All girls, please move to cootie quarantine. Give us your eggs. I'm a boy. We said eggs. <laughs> <laughs> yes! 
Remember this gift? The executive stress ball? One more squeeze and you're fired. <gasps> now I feel more stressed than ever. Ah! Oh! Ah! Hume and Young are born with the ability to count valentines, and Danny realizes he's been snubbed. Past generations of children were used to rejection, but today's kids, raised in a climate of video games and instant messaging, are fragile weirdos. Hey, where'd she go? Good, good, you held your tongue there. Because, hey, where'd you go? Doesn't anybody want me to give him advice? Okay there, Fido. When you see that squirrel outside, at first you play it cool, you understand? Well, GMOs are resistant to pests, disease, and drought. It's just possible that GMOs can actually end world hunger. I say let's get these GMOs inside our children. Pronto! Way ahead of you! <laughs> Figurines. Get your porcelain figurines. Could you take a picture of me with my family? Mm -hmm. Oh, would you take another for safety? Oh, I think my eyes were shut in that one. <laughs> now can you take one with my husband's camera? They're all ugly because you're in them! I'm a kid again! <laughs> oh, I'll save you! Why did you save me? We outlaws have to stick together. Outlaw? You? Stolen bowling shoes, 3D glasses, crusty standy, and this cage for my pet. Oh, what do you feed him? My ADD meds. Huh? Fat Tony? That's right. Fat Homer. Hey! But don't people hate cowards? Sure do, but we outlive the brave. Leaving us cowards to make time with the hero's widows. After Korea, I was drowning in boobies. Wow, that sounds pretty sweet. Clowns have it tough, Krusty. I understand. I was Professor Pickles with Ringling Brothers for several years. The elephant and I had our differences. God! Who made this monstrosity? I did everything! <laughs> You're never bored painting the Lord. folks have experienced. I think we could enjoy listening to a little of your wisdom. The problem with Puerto Ricans is no casual racism. <laughs> Springfield Nuclear has electric solutions to all of your energy needs. The Springfield Hyperloop This scooter, all of you, follow me to the future! <laughs> oh dear God, stick a forklift in him, he's dead. <laughs> hey, come on, all is not lost. This coast is fine. <laughs> I myself have done it when I was a student at MIT, the Mumbai Institute of Tantric Sex where I was recruited by a card-counting ring. I won enough money to buy fake SAT scores I used to get into the real MIT, where I failed every class and was kicked out and had to move to Springfield. Help us, Duff Man! Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Drink Duff! <laughs> Care to team up with Fruit Batman? I'm thinking of dumping Kid Sourpuss here. I'm a hero! Oh, I can see my obituary now. Wow. Wow! Bart, should I shut the door? No need. My mom's cool now. Check it out. Last night he stayed up till 10.45. Oh my god! I took a picture so I could show everybody. Ay ay ay. What hath mom wrought? The police are arresting basically anyone they want to. Lisa, you gotta learn to trust your government. 
That's what I do. Oh my god, I'm a monster. Mm-hmm. Wait, you can't go! I need your forgiveness! You can't push a guy around forever, Dad. You better take a long, fat look in the mirror. I know. Ah! Oh my god, Morty, what did you do? You killed oh the Simpsons, god. Morty! No, no, I, 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 I didn't oh, mean to! Oh, go, no, go, god, god, look at the baby the one! Oh my god, Morty! You killed the entire Simpsons, Morty! They're a beloved family, Morty! They're, 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 they're a national treasure, and you killed them! I, I, I'm just a kid! Huh, wow. Hey, Morty, little tip. Don't clean DNA vials with your spit. Let's go. I'm driving this time. Lisa Simpson also has an appalling odor. What? Oh, I don't smell. Girls don't smell. Sorry, girl, but you smell. She has a juice box. Why can't I have a juice box? Because when she sticks in the straw, she doesn't slip and hit an artery. Oh, I'll never have juice. Okay, well, uh, possum's gone. But you got fingernails to chew on. Who knows what's under them? Who? I got pizza. I got poop. Aw, oh, poor kid. Are you taking his dessert? Yes, I am. Up to him. Are you eating that cake? No. Hey, idiots, the bong stays in the treehouse. Hey, boy. <laughs> Are you crazy? What if the cops come? <laughs> I know you can't turn your head, but you've got a great view. Oh. Are you okay? Marge, he's got nine lives. I am a Hindu, sir, not a cat. I have infinite lives including some of which I may be a cat. In those, I do have nine. My father's enjoying his retirement. Baba Watson, you are no Vijay Singh. It will live at least until third grade when you get Mrs. Ortner. So I got back together with Jeff. Then, of course, I realized there was a reason we broke up. Well, that sounds awful, and you look stupid doing it. Do not panic, but the pools are infested with those tiny fish that swim up your wiener. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry, Doc! His lungs are full of seltzer! <laughs> <laughs> I can finally clean Grandpa's dentures. Yeah! I got popcorn in there from Kramer versus Kramer. I was rooting for Kramer, but was dismayed when Kramer finally won. That's a twist I didn't see, Kramer. In all my years of living with the female species, I've learned one thing. When they want to do something totally insane, your only move is to support them 100%. Hey guys, my uh, head's a little wet from the decontamination shower. Thanks. De nada. She pretty much sees the best in everything. Amazing, really. Considering she has a husband who randomly shows up to work, a son who, God bless him, is probably heading for the chair, and an ungrateful little girl who ignores her mother's frantic attempts at reconciliation and tells family secrets to a total stranger. Chubby dude in a tiny car Making friends both near and far I will make America great again. They're not so great. I will keep you on your toes. I will not run for a second term. I will walk. I will drill, baby, drill. Until I find the river of chocolate that lies beneath Hershey, Pennsylvania. This is so exciting. With my homie and a haberdashers, my husband needs a complete makeover. Well, thank you, lady with the beehive hair. <gasps> Empower your horse right through the sun. Blast a rainbow light from your empowerment gun. Okay, Plopper, I'm going to the little pig's room. Can you cover for me? Good, good, not that many mistakes at all. 
Okay, is that Homer or a pig that looks just like him? Sounds like Homer, but it smells like truffles. Toss in a bag of chips. Yep, that's Homer. The next day, my family explored Middlehampton, a wonderland of boutiques paid for by rich husbands wanting to keep their wives busy, mainly second wives. Each of my enterprises has its own G6. What's that one? That's for my <laughs> personal horticulturalist. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't. Time for the truth to be paid off. You're a lyrical made off. So if you want to go to war, bruh, hit me up and I'll write the rap for you. Yeah! Whoa, it rhymed! <laughs> I sing JG, pimp, lie, and ride. Took my handyman off a job. And when I complained, all he did was laugh. Now I got half a gazebo and not even a good half. Ha ha! You have a conscience! Ugh. Closed set! My mom's dating your gaffer. Jack, is that true? I'm not proud of it. You seem pretty proud when you ate all our ramen noodles. Who stole the cookie from the cookie jar? Tyler stole the cookie from the cookie jar. What? Me? Yeah, yeah you. you. Couldn't be. Then, then who? Courtney stole the cookie from the cookie jar. I've heard enough. Let's go, Courtney. You too, Tyler. In the morning, we saw the horrors of the beaches at Iwo Jima. This is a sports documentary. I'm getting there. In my unit, they called me quarterback, because when I borrowed a quarter, I never gave it back. At the end of the war, I had a buck seventy-five and no friends. Certificates, Certificates ribbons, ribbons, and yes, yes. even trophies. <gasps> <gasps> trophies. So that's the easy answer. If Ralphie Shelf says he's a winner, then he'll be one. And Mo yells a third thing to feel part of the group. <laughs> gotcha! Where am I? You walked in the car. We better seal this thing up tight. Lipo! Hey, who wants a box full of fire trackers? They won't light up the night like you. Oh. Oh, you're quite good at taking the piss out of someone. Wait, that's okay to say? Taking the piss. Taking the piss, taking the piss, taking the piss, taking the piss. Have you gotten that out of your system? I'll get up in the middle of the night and say one more. Experienced Peaky Mon searchers. Hmm. This is who we're looking for. No, oh, you're no fun. What's her Peaky name? Um, Dame Judy Dentures. Oh. <laughs> and her point value? I don't know, a zillion? <laughs> Cause he's one, two. Three guys in one at the baseball church. church. I don't care what people say. My homie makes one sexy blimp. Go long, boys. <clears throat> hey, Harold, buddy. You know, I was wondering. Excuse me, why cheeseburgers? The cheese holds it together in flight. Duh. I mean, why do you throw them at good people? Question time is over. Really hope that social worker pays better by the time you grow up. <laughs> social worker. Private Homer, you fat stack of mop buckets. You find something funny about this? How about I wipe that smile off your fat face? Not my homie. Avert your eyes, ma'am. Boy, am I lost. Shaq, can you help us? I'm not Superman. You have a Superman tattoo on your arm. How do you know so much about me? You're scaring me. I don't have any money. All right, Ralphie, easy, easy. Give Daddy back his hat. It was a simple matter of finding the guards identical twins, then hiring them to rob their own brothers. That's the last impossible mystery you'll ever solve. Whoa! In the words of the late David Bowie, nay Jones, ch 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 changes All rights reserved, Ziggy's Artist Publishing. Gotcha! 
<laughs> Morning, friend, till the end. Ready to greet the day with a big ho-hey? Call me the Pillsbury Doughboy, cause I'm ready to roll. Then let's high diddly go. If anyone can do it, it's we to it. Yes, doodly May I ask you, how are things in heaven? You know that thing we used to call reefer, and you people now call medicine? I do. Well, they have it up in heaven, and it is mighty fine. Mighty fine. <laughs> Me? Look who's here. Yeah, I see. Oh, Homer, are you a Sunday puzzle? Because you sure seem down and across. My dad did something to me I can never forgive. No worse than what God did to his son, and they wrote a book together. Bye. Oh, let me scratch your chin. He's so chubby, I just can't take it. Okay, got through the first one. Next one's a little harder. Just gonna focus. <coughs> ah! yeah. And post. Ah! Ah! Post. Ah! Post. Ah! Post. Uh, unpost! Unpost! And post. Hmm. Look at those abs. The secret is less loaves, more fishes. Thy kingdom come. I'm almost done. Ooh, can this square join your circle? Absolutely, puzzle In that same spirit, I'm glad to hear it. Oh, hi, dum dum diddly. Diddly, brother. Diddly, diddly, diddly. Diddly, brother. Diddly, meet you. Lisa, do you know how I've gotten to this point in life? Two things blind faith. And a little wine. Can you get me the wine that I keep in Mommy's knitting basket? I know where you keep it. There was no knitting in there. Hey! Oh, that, I got my home lady. And I'm so kids. And that fire go out. And I'm a stupid flander. Homer, Cargo is on the forefront of autonomous vehicle technology. We're looking for highly passive humans to road test our self-driving cars. Perfect answer. No operator, the car just drives itself. Its computer brain knows where the roads are. Living in LA with my best old ex-friend, Ray. My client, uh, Homer Simpson, is suing you. I am not a pretend attorney. I am Homer's liar. Lawyer. Goodbye. Nothing like eating fish sticks. <coughs> oh, my eyes! In the words of King Solomon, I shall eat two pies. I don't think King Solomon said that. Maybe it was a King Salmon. The point is, pies are good. Where's your boy? What's your hurry, friend? Now, Homer, don't you try to disarm us with your genteel mannerisms of a bygone era there. Why, I haven't a notion as to what you are importuning, good sir. This is not about my car. It is about me getting respect. I want all the little Lulus five dollars can buy. And make it snappy, Blob of the Hut. Chaba is actually quite slim for a hut. This is Maggie, our baby. And she understands what's going on. She's never said a word. But I get the feeling she wants to say something now. Me, da, di. What a man. I will render my sentence tomorrow. I thank you. Good night. Boom. Wait, wait, wait. You want to go to a movie? I'll go to a movie with you, Judge. You won't be available. No. Oh. When I first met Bart, I was just a nerdy kid with glasses. But now this blue-haired butterfly's ready to emerge from his pupa. Simpson, you think this is helping you? <laughs> Skinner's a jerk. 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 <sighs> Everything's breakfast all the time. Eggs. All I'm eating are eggs. I think it's turning my skin yellow. Homie, are we sacrificing our family's happiness for the sake of one member? When Lisa's making millions of dollars playing for the Utah Jazz, it'll be worth it. Tibetan singing bowls. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
Welcome to Walk Off Homer. This is Homer Simpson, the rudest dude on the inner tube. They say Muhammad Ali was the greatest of all time, but he never fought Cassius Clay. Eat Sunset Rose! Wow, semi gloss. <laughs> 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 what the hell so funny? <laughs> okay, Homer, you can do this. You can make things right. <laughs> I got your coffee just the way you like it. No coffee, just donut holes. <laughs> Hey, Lenny, you duck face psycho. Guess who's going to Homer Simpson's house for a meal? Me! Uh, I'm Carl. Homie? Homie? Oh, you ruined that body in one night? The funeral leftovers were so good. That thing is huge. At least this is a new feeling. We helped a whale be free, and now I feel wonderful. What you're searching for is altruism. <laughs> oh, you got a boat for the day. Did you bring beer and sandwiches? Why don't you open that? Hey, Midge, got your beer and sandwiches right here. Look, the gorillas have picked up some new habits from your father. Long day's journey into light beer. Where's my beer, Marjorie? I spent all day making sure this beer was cold. Ah! I make bad choices. Oh, this trip's gonna cost how much? I know it's expensive, but we spend our whole lives worrying about money. That's because we don't have that much. We have a mortgage, a reverse mortgage. I think the house is owned by the car. Relax, I learned how to do this from my uncle Two Fingers. Oh my god, you're the package thief? Um, uh. You can't spoil that movie for me, because I don't care what happens. You see, as a grown-up, I know that muscle jerks and tights with magic powers punching and hugging each other is boring BS for babies. How much longer do I have to keep up this kookaburra charade? How badly do you not want your bosses at Marble Studios to know that I used your drunken thumb to see that movie? Ooh. <sighs> uh, listen, stupid Flanders. I just want to say thank you, and if there's anything I can do for you... Well, for starters, you could stop calling me Stupid Flanders. Deep-fried rib witch, served on a warm donut, or a spaghetti-filled grilled cheese sandwich drizzled with ranch pudding. Krusty's munchy mouthfuls. It's high time you tried it. Get it? Get it? Get it? <laughs> I get it. I think something is very wrong with him. I think maybe we should take him to a dog psychologist. Dog psychologist, eh? Get off the couch. Get off. Get off. Dad, they're coming for our dog. I won't let you, you, you big blue balloon. Oh, I like the image. Hey, imagine me in a parade, huh? Ha, ah, boy. Oh, darn it. <laughs> Hope you're hungry, Homer. I got up at 2 a.m. and slow roasted a breakfast turkey. Sorry, no time for food. I gotta get to work. <laughs> well, at least in the city, we don't all die at 60 from butter-clogged heart failure. Oh, don't go. Maybe they've got some lentils you can milk. Or acorns. <laughs> To fat guys with hot wives. This one's for you, Kevin James. Golf is about privilege. Fine, but someday I'm gonna be a member here and I'm gonna be cool to the caddies. Oh, you a member? Oh, look, you made Chadlington laugh. Oh, oh, oh. oh contraction! 
Oh, if only that pregnant woman would stop that bracket so I could think. You could deliver the baby. Wait, who are you? I'm your brain. How come I haven't heard from you before? Your stomach gets all the blood. You shut up about that. I know where you live. You were born with a full set of teeth, and here they are. Where are my dentures? I got a hot date tonight, and I want to show off by eating chicken. Smithers, a toast. <laughs> On it, sir. I think you've had enough, sir. Yes, yes, I'll, I'll sleep it off. Well, it's a good thing Dad got this truck. Oh, yeah, my Steve God, Mark, I never want to hear another word about the this truck. The truck is truck. awesome. So you don't get it, and you never will. I wish I was married to Bart. Tequila. No! Isn't that your dad? No. It's nice to laugh again. How are you? Oh, I'm, I'm doing great. Yeah, the factory closed, so there's lots of new drunks, and, uh, oh, the bathroom possum is getting real good at handing out them combs. The only way to defeat a global data behemoth is to get into the source code. Just look what I did here on, uh, on the Wikipedia. Oh. Hello? Honey, I'm here in the alley with Mo. The only woman who ever loved him came back, and he's afraid she's gonna leave him again. What should he do? Hand him the phone. Mo, trust love. Gotcha. Your wife's an idiot. Barb, if I were to kiss you right now, would, uh... Would that be all right? Golly, it sure would. Hot dog! Well, bye. Dad, would you like to come in and see my javelin medals? Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, you bet. Diddly. Mm. That's the business. Mm. Doodly. Oh, good golly, Miss Molly. Mm. Great golly. Do you think I should call the police? Oh, no. If she calls the police, Homer's dead. If I want to save his life, I have to tell a lie. Uh, Homer, uh, uh, stopped by here last night and, 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 and apologized for being a jerk to me and, and, uh, you know, then he hopped on a bus to Shelbyville for a, a, a three-day anger management course at the airport, uh, uh, Hyatt, Hyatt Express. Hmm? Oh, shoot. I'll stop. Oh, let him go. He can wear it with the diamond brooch he buried last week. Well, I'll drink to that. Darling, you drink to everything. Ooh. Ooh.